I think I was originally drawn to writing because uh, of the lifestyle that it would afford you. Like I just wanted to, when we were kids, when I say we, like me and my brothers were kids, uh, we had we had these like occupations we knew about that we, we thought would allow you to be outside a lot. So you'd be that you'd want to be a game warden, you'd want to be a wildlife biologist, uh, you'd want to be a writer, an outdoor writer, just like things that would let you be outside. So it was originally a uh, lifestyle that I thought it would afford you. And then pretty quick I like fell in love with the actual thing, like the actual process of writing. I, I don't I, I don't know any writers that actually like to write, but I, I like um you know, it's a it's been said by many people better than this but uh i like having written stuff i like getting it done um more than doing it but the feeling of like getting things done or finishing a book is is great uh so i guess it's it's you, you kind of get addicted to that feeling of completing things to the best of your ability within the time that you're given to do it um and that, that's probably something that speaks to me really well and i also just appreciate when someone conveys information well, conveys information efficiently, conveys information in a way that's entertaining so that the people that are getting educated uh, don't know they're getting educated maybe, or they're, they're enjoying the process rather than have it be onerous or you know taxing on them. Um, I, I just, yeah, all those things speak to me. I've been writing, well, I think I sold my first, like I actually got paid for my first article probably around 99, 1999 or 2000. Um, but I had started writing before then. I had, from the time I was 10 to the time I was 22, I was very into trapping, uh, all manner of things, uh, fur trapping, you know, and I really wanted to make a career out of that, but it became obvious that that wasn't a plausible career. So I had a plan B that I would be an outdoor writer, even though I didn't know what that meant too much. Um, What's funny is now when I give people uh, career advice, I tell them don't have a plan B because plan B will be like easy and seductive and it'll divert you from plan A. But I was a plan B guy, <laughs> became a writer <laughs> instead of a trapper.